So good morning, do not adjust your sets. That is the sun in the sky in the UK. It does happen. Feel your blue so deep in you, I'm blinded by your bittersweet shine. I get what you need, I'll make you feel free, be mine tonight. You can get through, you can limp through there. <laughs> oh, I think everybody's gone round the outside. Look, no, not that way. Hey, your bars might be too wide. <laughs> you stuck? You gonna do it? Whee! <laughs> so, hello, welcome back to a new video. This isn't the video I was planning on making today. I had everything set up. I got up nice and early to put the bike in the car. I need to go out and find I had a massive puncture in the front tire of my Trek. I tried to seal it. I tried replacing it. I tried plugging it and I couldn't fix it. A uh, bit too messy to put an inner tube in. So I didn't bother. I thought I've got my Canyon in the house or that I've been using on the turbo. So I went to get the Canyon and believe it or not, there's something wrong with the free hub and it won't when you stop pedaling it wants to chuck the chain off and chuck you off the bike so i couldn't use that one either so a couple of hours of being very angry and i'm now out in the sunshine with my wife i'm gonna go get some lunch and enjoy this sunshine i didn't think about it at the time but i put the gravel tires on the bike and i can actually go out and do a little gravel spin so a lot of time wasted today <laughs> But we're out on the bike, that's the main thing. And it's looking incredible in the sunshine. So we're just out in Glastonbury. This is uh, Hamwell Nature Reserve, which isn't far from our door. I've literally only done five kilometers to get here. Uh, and it is looking splendid this morning. So we have no plan, nowhere to go, nowhere to be. We're just gonna pedal around, find somewhere for lunch and enjoy this sunshine and this fresh air. Does this count as a hill? <laughs> you can go left, just go left and go round. Morning. Morning. Hey. You don't want to go uh, getting wet already. There's another gate, you'll get through this one, it's wider. Give me your love and tell me your secrets. Cause we're in this together now. Yeah, we're in this together now. <laughs> oh, it hit it with my shoulder. Actually, I just had a thought, Deb. We didn't actually stick anything in my tyre, so I take you out today, did you? <laughs> she definitely doesn't want to be filmed. So if this actually makes it into a video, that's my wife. That's my beautiful wife. Say hello to Debbie. So anyway, that's the final straw for tubeless for me. Morning. I'm switching back over to inner tubes. I've had so many problems since I went to tubeless. I had so many punctures. And it seems like every time you get a nick in one of the tires, you end up with a puncture. And then it doesn't seal. And if it's too big, you're struggling. It's, <laughs> it's just terrible. I say when I was on inner tubes, I don't think I very rarely had a puncture. It's probably one a year. I'm going to switch back to some Conti 5000 GPs and uh, put them on here. 
with some inner tubes and uh, let's see how they go because <laughs> it can't get any worse than the tubers. We've run out of gravel dip, it's thrown away. <laughs> <laughs> that might be a bit mucky then then. We can see. Is that too no, mucky? That. I know, is it too mucky? What's it like after it? It's just one puddle after another. We can turn around if you want. Yeah, it was a lot drier in the summer when we did it on the glorious gravel. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't want to get dirty today. Or do you want to get dirty today Deb? <laughs> And she's also loads of sticks from the from all the storms across the bride away there so it's puncture city i've had enough of that today already i definitely don't want another one Oh no, <laughs> that went very badly. <laughs> oh, it's bumpy and squishy and spinny. Oh, there's, there's, there is gravel, it's <laughs> down there. <laughs> right at the very end, we've got to get through that. We just come past that turn. Oh yeah, we can come back past that turn, just do that gravel. That's not even fucking gravel, is it? Well, it was for a bit. We'll go Are first. you going to let me go first? <laughs> I'll go first for them. Those towers look awful. They're like um, scales. Morning comes at night, messed up again. Because we're doing everything wrong. I don't know and I don't understand. When we fight somehow, we always make a threat. Now I've got to wait for her to catch up because she's got the other camera. <laughs> I did actually bring her down here once on the tandem, but we went the other way. She wasn't happy that day. <laughs> yes, we've been here before. Turn the gravel. These things are absolutely awful. And they scatter all the way across the southwest now. <laughs> anyway, do you want to go to Burnham, right on the beach? An ice cream involved. An ice cream? It's not that warm. It's been a long, hard season I'm feeling weary to my bones I guess that's my reason I packed my bags and now I'm gone Somewhere between the sun and the deep blue sea Just like that, we're in Burnham. Let's see if I can persuade her to ride on the beach though. <laughs> What do you reckon? Yes or no? Do you want to ride on the beach? You can't burn it, let's ride on the beach. Just don't fall off. The tide says we can't get out there. Did it. Wheelie! <laughs> Use your bike to lean on. Hop across on your bike. And just jump. Just jump.
<laughs> I get a little bit breathless My thoughts are too big Can I get some comfort please I guess I should have been honest A break to my heart It's weighing me down baby you can keep going all the way to Breen, yeah. You're doing better than Pete, he fell off twice by now. Look <laughs> at the White Tower. It's, I don't know, it's a life, lifeguard tower, isn't it? I think. Oh! <laughs> Potholes on the beach. Uh, we can come back or we can carry on. I think you can get off. Too late, but I can see past the rain. Won't you lay it on me? Turn the page and burn it. Let's make up a big bonfire on the beach with the stars as our lighters and throw our problems in. Your turn to dance now. Dancing Seagull, dancing Debbie. <laughs> yeah, nobody wants to see that done. I don't know what kind of juggers they have in Burnham. Drinking coffee dangerous? Absolutely, yeah. How many cups have you got? Uh, I've got two. Um, the cake is also mine. Um, what did you get? <laughs> Go on, show us how it's done. What? 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 Go out. You're in right, so this wasn't the ride I planned. This isn't the video I intended to make, but it's the one I've made. <laughs> I think it'll be alright. Um, also realised halfway round, I've put the gravel wheels on and I haven't got the gravel inner tube. I've got an inner tube in the front bag for the other tyres, but I haven't got one for <laughs> these wheels. I know Deb's got one for a 40 tyres, so I would have been alright, I think. Anyway, we will hopefully get out on Wednesday and make another video and try and get a video ahead of the game to get back to the 7 o'clock Sunday morning schedule. Anyway, I was throwing all my toys out the pram earlier. I was having a right old sulk thinking I couldn't get out. So I want to thank Deb for dragging me out because I've actually enjoyed coming out now. We've had a lot of fun, been down to the beach. Always go to the beach when the sun's out. Don't usually go to Burnham though. I should also say she's just done 62 kilometers. We've still got a couple of kilometers to get home. That's the longest ever bike ride on her own, under her own power. So, well done Deb. We've managed 71 meters of climbing. <laughs> it's pro probably the flattest I've ever ridden. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And say hello to Deb in the comments if she lets me post it. But we will see you in the next video. No, I ain't got the camera out. You're all right. <laughs> <laughs>